Good afternoon, and we're going to do a beautiful song today that came out by a band called Audio Slave. Lead singer was Chris Cornell, who went on to sing that acoustically many times and sang it at the Hanover, I do believe. I wasn't there. He uh, was there about five or six months before he passed away. Um, but we're going to, this is one that I'm going to put out there for the beginning. Students just starting to play because there's some chords in this that are pretty simple. And there's also some chords that are not as difficult to learn at first. But basically throughout the verses, there's four chords that repeat themselves over and over again. And then when we get to the chorus, it goes A minor, C, G, A minor. Not too bad, huh? Then again, A minor, C, G, A minor. Then F, A minor. Then, then F, E. She's got an A minor, very simple chord. First finger goes on the first fret of the second string. Second finger goes on the second fret of the fourth string. And underneath that, the third finger goes on the second fret of the third string. It's a little strum. A couple measures. The next chord is a G. And I'm going to show you the full G today uh, because it really sounds good in this song, and that's the way Chris played it. Um, take your first finger and put it on the second fret of the fifth string, your second finger on the third fret of the sixth string, your third finger on the third fret of the second string and your fourth finger on the first fret. I mean the third fret of the first string. Take a look at it. Take a close look. Yeah, see? See you got the two fingers here and one and then two. That's a full G. So we start out with the A minor. Then you, you can do that with just one finger. Take your second finger and put it on the second fret of the fifth string. Now this next one isn't so easy. It's an F chord and you're going to put your first finger right across the first fret and then kind of form an E chord in front of that. Put your second finger on the second fret of the third string. Your third finger on the third fret of the fifth string and your fourth finger on the third fret of the fourth string. So you kind of, if I was to take this first finger away, I kind of got an E chord. But I put it down. It's still an F, no matter how you, no matter how you look at it. So that's the next chord anyways. Uh, e minor. So let's start out again from the beginning, okay? We'll start with the A minor. G. E minor seventh. I used my pinky on the third, second string to hit at that time. Just an urge I have sometimes. Here we go. A minor. G. E minor seventh. 
Did I? A minor G, E minor seventh to F. And if you want, I like sometimes to throw. I didn't do it this time, but the, on the A, on the E minor seventh, to let that second string ring out a little bit. G, right here. Back to the F right there. And it goes into the chorus right here. Now that goes A minor to C to G to A minor. Again, A minor to C to G to A minor. F to A minor. F to E. Pretty much, I think. We'll find out. <laughs> so it starts out with that A minor. In your heart, I to be back to the A minor, so uh, room by room, patiently into an F, wait for you there. Like a, uh, you ever, like a stone. I'll wait for you there Like a stone Then F I'll wait for you there Then E alone Alone Then, what do you think we got coming next? Would it be the A minor to G, the E minor 7 to F? You, you read that right. That's what it's going to be. Anybody get down to see Brit Floyd the other night on Wednesday? Boy, it was that something. That was, uh, Happening time, I was lucky enough to go. Now, uh, next verse starts out with on my deathbed, yeah, with the same chords. Deathbed, I will pray to the gods and the angels like a pagan to G. E minor seventh, B to F heaven. Then goes to right here. Um, through uh, right to the A minor again. I recall I was gone so long ago. Then it goes into. Um, so long ago, you'll forgive me if I forget a couple of verses. If this is a guitar lesson, right? Um, but no, <laughs> to a place I recall, I was there so long ago. The sky was bruised, the wine bled, and then you led me on. Change it all. A minor, you will see how G, I won't be. Again, oops, patiently 
you don't ever want to do that. I just went from the A minor to the G when I was supposed to go from the A minor to the C. And it really threw me for a loop. I don't know about you folks, but see? Even after all these years, you can still have a full five. Anyway, she goes A minor, A minor, um, C, G, A minor. sounding lead right here because we're in the key of A minor, uh, key of C, could do a pentatonic or you could do a major scale actually um, except for on the G and the E minor or you could shift around the chord so if we start save it right down here. Basically, all I'm doing is uh, an A minor, A pentatonic, pretty much. When once in a while, I'm throwing in a major scale. And then using the chords a little bit for the lead, so I, now you. If I come down here, right, I'm going to show you this A minor chord here on the fifth fret. Take your first finger and put it across the first, second, and third strings on the fifth fret. Your third finger on the seventh fret. And play this one open, the fifth string. Now the scale goes like this. One to four or five to eight. Then one to four or five to eight on the frets, that is. One to uh, three or five to seven. One and three or five to seven. So we go basically five, seven, five, seven, five, eight, five, eight. So we got You could. stayed in the boundaries on that one okay that's a good thing when you first start learning because it gives you like a safety zone you know a place to go back to 
sometimes when you've been playing for years you still go back to it too but now the last verse goes um we start out with the uh well, he's, he's reading, you know, during this whole time, a book about death, and, um, and this last verse, um, it starts with an F. Um, I'm red to a C, then to an E, until the day was gone, to an F. So right there, we're going from a... Um, C A minor E minor rather E E F so F C E F F C E F on oh, my red Till the day was gone, and I sat F minor to a D, but all the things I've done, A minor, then we'll go back here to the F again, for all that I see, blessed, and all that I to an F minor again. Um, so that went from F, all that I'm blessed, and then an A minor to uh, on, on F, F rather, all that I'm blessed, then E minor to E rather straight, all that I'm gone, then F from that I've read till the day was gone then an F minor just pick up your second finger and sat pretty pretty it's used more frequently in rock and roll than we, than we think it is. I sat to a D, regret to an E for all the things I've done in A minor. And that's for all that I've blessed to see. That are wrong, F, right there, oops, all that are wrong. So it goes, F that I see, E, F, then it ends in dreams until my death. I will want. Till my death, I will wander on in my life. In your house, I want me to get room by room. She patiently, I wait for you there. She like a stone. I wait for you there. Oh. And then just ends on an F. Saranata, I hope you have this wonderful day today, as I am, even though the weather is not so great, but hey, who cares? Have a good one. Peace. God bless you. I hope you learned something from that. I'll send out a little, I'll send that out to a little note with some chords in it and stuff for you folks just learning, okay? If you have any questions or 
you want to make any comments about it, give me, uh, give me a note, okay? Peace.